Palmer, as Rufe Kweku Ose is affectionately called, was disqualified from the elections because of his failure to pay 10% of the transfer fee of Joseph Pinsel and his comments that Ghana failed to qualify for World Cup 2018 because of government's decision to stop the GFA from making indemnity payments. Ose appealed the decision at the Court of Arbitration for Sport, who would on Friday award a ruling. Amanda Clinton, who was a candidate during the elections and a lawyer of the GFA when government took steps to dissolve the association after number 12, has been speaking about the likely factors that would influence a final ruling. In terms of the CAS decision this Friday, where it will be determined if Pana or say was deliberately excluded from competing um, in the GFA presidential election 2018, I haven't actually had a chance to review the full evidence before CAS in Palmer's case. Um, what I can say, however, is that CAS will look at whether Palmer was discriminated against in terms of being excluded from competing at the GFA presidential election 2019. They will also be looking at whether, objectively speaking, it can be said that Palmer has proven unfair exclusion if indeed that was the case, which I really don't know. Questions have surrounded the legality of the 10% transfer fee to the FA since Parliament's disqualification. The general regulations of the GFA makes it legit, and Amanda anticipates CAS will clarify that regulation. Palmer CAS will have their own interpretation of whether it can be said that Palmer had an obligation to pay a GFA for the transfer of a player. Maybe he legally did, maybe he didn't. I haven't seen paperwork. However, compared to other football winners and presidential candidates 2018, it may be unfair to have excluded just him, so exclude all at the first election or include all, failing which include all now at the new election 2020. This depends on whether CAS takes the minimization committee's role as the ultimate decision maker who had the right to assemble whichever vetting committee they wanted and took the recommendations of the vetting committee. Palmer is demanding four release from the appeal, one of which is an order for the GFA to organize fresh elections if the award is in his favor.